Hey everyone, today I'm just going to talk about uh, one of the things I do to add nutrients to my plants and that's using Epsom salts. Uh, Epsom salts, some people don't know, it's not actually a salt, it's just a magne magnesium uh, sulfite which is uh, those two compounds basically. Um, they're both uh, very good for your plant. Magnesium adds in uh, chlorophyll production and uh, I believe that sulfur helps with uh, some sort of root, root development or stronger uh, stems, I believe. Um, so I'm just going to show simply how you can apply this. One way you might have heard of is to just take, you know, a half gallon sized uh, container and uh, mix uh, about half a tablespoon of this with it. Um, that's a nice simple way to do it. it works with most plants. Uh, another thing though with things like tomatoes, you might want to uh, just spread them separately. It can be quicker. Uh, let me just show you. Yeah, so the rule of thumb is basically for tomatoes to add one tablespoon per foot of plant. This one's a little more than a foot, uh, but it doesn't have a lot of foliage. got kind of whacked around. So I'm just going to go for one uh, tablespoon per foot for that. Do that with my other ones. See, if I do it this way, it's a lot quicker than mixing up a whole bunch of water. So that's what I'm going to do. There you go, I've added it to quite a variety of plants here, not just tomatoes, also peppers, even some tropicals, uh, and uh, it'll do well. Uh, you know, good for tomatillos as well. And yeah, now it's just time to water them. As you can see, just taking the Epsom salts, just spreading them to each pot, it's pretty quick. This didn't take me very long, now I'm just gonna water them, and the job's done. Thanks for watching.